Hey, Asa here with No Bones About Wrestling, and I'm here to talk to you about this uh, newest AEW All Elite crate. So, uh, I don't know what the theme is. They usually have a theme. They're usually themed after one of their pay-per-views. So, I guess this one might be Revolution, which is coming up in March, uh, just, just under two months from now, uh, which we're going to, actually. Um... But I don't know, so I, I have not opened it yet. I, I took the tape off, but that's all I did. So I literally have not seen what's inside. So let's find out together. Here's a little card that tells you what's inside. So we'll just set that to the side for right now. Comes with two t-shirts, always in your size. And Sometimes uh, some of them are exclusive, or are they all exclusive? They're all exclusive. They're all exclusive to the Elite Crate. Oh shit, that's cool. Adam Copeland rated R superstar shirt. That is cool. I like that. That's awesome. Yeah, that's that's a good normally one. Edge stuff looks a little like bikery and kind of not great, but yeah. that's great. Yeah, yeah. This one looks cool too, and I don't even know who it is yet. Looks like FDR. Yes, it is. That's a cool oh, shirt. Oh, did I guess it? Yeah. FTR, Living Legends. Awesome. That's an awesome looking shirt there. Yeah, that's, they sent some good shirts. That's a these. winner right there. Yeah. I'm building a very nice AEW shirt collection with these, uh, with these uh, elite crates here. They sent me a pair of scissors. Oh, I guess they're acclaimed scissors. They're pink. <laughs> Yeah, they say the acclaimed on them there. In very small writing. Sorry. So. That's hilarious. Their official claim scissors. I don't think you want to stick these up anyone's cunt, really, you know? What the fuck are you talking about? Scissoring. I don't think you know what that is. Don't I? No, apparently not. I think I do. I don't think you do. I think I do. Got a Dan Housen patch. Oh, cool. I've got a Luchasaurus micro brawler. That's Kill Switch. Oh, it's Luchasaurus it's on there. It's Luchasaurus. Yeah, it's Luchasaurus. This is before he became Kill Switch. So he'll probably go on the wall back here with my other micro brawlers. Very cool. Or on eBay, one of those two places. They may all go on eBay. I've got a He's Our Scumbag uh, enamel pin here. Oh, with the uh, plaid, plaid scarf. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Cool. We've got AEW Property of Sanjay Dutt pencils. <laughs> that's not as funny as the scissors, but no. that's pretty funny. <laughs> So I guess this one doesn't have a thing. Is the theme back to school? I don't know. If the theme's back to school, it's like six months too late. Yeah. This one doesn't have much of a theme, I guess. We've got an MJF and Brian Danielson 60-minute Iron Man match poster there. Pretty cool. That is cool. Which I'll get framed at some point. Soon, I hope. Got to frame all these posters from these packs here. Let's see, we got we got a flag. I've already got a, I've got a Brian Danielson flag upstairs, and we've got a um, Frisco Brothers Frisco Brothers flag right here. See, this one may replace the Briscoe Brothers flag. We'll see. Oh, no. I don't know. Just for something new. It look, it's a little more interesting to the eyes already. It's black, white, and red. We'll see who it is, though. That's Samoa Joe? Is it? Looks it's like a Samoa it. Samoa Joe flag. Yes, it is. That's pretty cool. The new AEW World Heavyweight Champion. It may replace the Briscoe Brothers flag. We'll see. No. Just for something new back there, you know? 
You know, it's been up for a while. And as always, we get an autographed. That's our dog outside. We get an autographed uh, wrestler eight by ten. Let's see who we have this month. It looks like a lady. It is sky blue. So I think this one we go on eBay. Not a fan. So overall thoughts on the crate? Uh, pretty good until we got to the sky blue. I mean, you know, to the sky blue thing. Uh, the uh, little micro brawler. We'll probably probably keep going up here, even though nobody can see them. Um. They might go up there. They may eventually go to eBay. Pencils may be an eBay thing. The sky blue is definitely going on eBay. Or if you're watching this video and you, you have any interest, you can, you know, get at me. Uh, um, but overall, I like it. You know, the, the poster is cool. All these posters have been very good. They've marked some momentous matches in AEW. The shirts have all been very good. The, the flag is very cool, and the acclaimed scissors and the, the uh, MJF pen, very cool. So, for the value, you really can't beat it, you know. It's mm -hmm. it's always been a, an excellent value, you know. What's the cost of one shirt normally, like with shipping included and stuff? Well, if you want, well, the, like a normal shirt, usually, is like, with shipping, ends up being like 35 at least. Mm -hmm. Um... But here you get for a one one pack one elite crate is forty dollars, and and that includes two shirts. Um, and so far, I haven't had anyone that I don't like. It's hard to find people in AEW I don't like. I mean, Sky Blue is one. Um, I'm trying to think who else. There aren't many I just don't care for. Anna J. I don't know. She seems nice. She's not a good wrestler, I so I don't, I don't like her as a wrestler. I, don't, I wouldn't really wear an Anna J shirt. That would go to eBay. I think who else? I don't know. Anyways, but yeah. Uh, very good crate, as always. Um, give it... Uh, give it four and a half bones out of five just the the autograph is a big part of it and this this month this is the first month that i, I was not impressed with the autograph picture uh the others are all going to get framed and this one like i said is, is headed to ebay so uh yeah another good one and i would definitely recommend the Oli crates